All right. Well, I thought I'd make a little video for my best friend, John, who's such a good friend, I can't remember his last name, sent me some stuff that I ordered from his new website. So we'll do a little unboxing video. Normally I wouldn't do anything like this, but for John and Lisa, I'll make an exception. So let's see. I think the website went live last Thursday. And today is Tuesday. Message. We got some uh, fish food. A little message here. That's what we ordered. I can't read the signature, so I'm going to say it's probably John's. I've been meaning to try Extreme for a while. Um, having a fish room and breeding program. Um, I go through a lot of food. Uh, so something like this is, uh, it's good, with, especially with angel fish, it's good to feed a variety of food. Uh, it helps prevent colon head disease. Um, it's good to just offer them a variety. And, and the other reason too is uh, every once in a while, some foods may not be available. So if they're stuck on one food, you know, sometimes it's nice to, you know, have something else that you know they'll eat too. So we're going to try some krill flakes. Um, I feed a lot of krill uh, or... Uh, like the, uh, the jumbo krill, the freeze-dried, I crush it up and give it to my angels, the golden angels, and some of the other fish that I have that have any orange or red coloring in them, it really brings out that color. So what do we got here? So we got a, another smaller jar of krill flakes. That one, uh, that one was a little bonus there. Thanks, John or Lisa. Uh, the next one we got is the community peewee. Uh, it's about what I'm looking for too. About the size, I think it's. Let's see if it says the size on here. It's the one and a half millimeter pellets. Uh, so anywhere from. Just under two. I don't like getting into the two or three millimeter pellets for angelfish. Uh, they've been able to choke on them. Um, you know, they don't often eat anything really big. Even the freeze dried krill, I got to bust up. So, um, but uh, it's a good community food. So I'm gonna give this a try. I have some other cichlids and some imbunas. Um, so. I, uh, I'll probably try this with them and just give it to the angels here and there and see how they like it. So. And the last one is the uh, Natural Intense Color Enhancer. And that's a 1.5 millimeter tube. And it's a slow sinking pellet, so that'll be good. Um, we'll see how, again, we'll see how the angels and some of the other South American cichlids I have like that uh, they sing too fast, and they don't like digging in the bottom for it. Occasionally they will, but most of the time they like picking it out of the water column. So, All right, so that's it. Nice little package of food, one little extra from them. I appreciate that. Uh, we'll put the small one in the house and uh, for the kids to fish, and the bigger one will stay out here for these guys. And in fact, while, while I'm doing this, we'll actually give these angels front of us. These are my latest batch. These are actually golden zebras and the black ones are from the same parents and they got kind of a zebra lace tail. They're kind of a cool cool looking black angel. Uh, black angels are really hard to find uh, so anytime I bring in black angels to a pet store they go fast. Uh, in fact I was just down there today and there's one little tiny angel off on the right, 
and all of his angels are still that size, even though they're all siblings of these and we're all born at the same time. I feed a lot more than a pet store does, so um, these guys uh, are starting to color up, and so something like this crow flake is really going to help their color start to pop because these will get a brighter gold crown to them. Some of them are starting to show it, but this food should help, so let's give them some of this. These fish just ate like an hour ago. So if they weren't hungry or if this food didn't taste good, they probably wouldn't be squirming it like this. So we'll see how that does. Again, that's not going to be an everyday thing. That's going to be a couple of times a week, something like that. Um, just kind of a filling. So hope you guys enjoyed. And John and Lisa, thanks for the, uh, thanks for the food and thanks for carrying product again.